what you do, I know me to be rude If you know mad, I go like you did to your boo If you know the level, I give you the level No, they show me level, I'm a more C-level C-level, 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 C-level Shake your bump and a bump and a kick, 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 kick C-level, 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 C-level Make it go down, I go down, I kick, 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 kick C-level, 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 C-level Take it on, down, on, down, I kick, 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 kick C-level, C-level over the years, Nigerian male Afrobeat musicians have identified with the style of rocking single or multiple diamond pieces and sneakers as a mark of luxury. Nigerian celebrities, Kogba Gidi, the international promoter, ex-Big Brother Niger housemates, IK, Father DMW, Cash Money, amongst others, were present at the first Lakers appearance of the young entrepreneurs. Sneakers Lord, Usag Usi Otupa, and Godson Ume, who is famous for creating luxury diamond pieces locally and internationally. So we had to support my guy, Godson. So classy, you know, so wonderful to see an event like this where, you know, entrepreneurs can show us what they have. and. Uh, yeah, and I'm happy to promote, support. Yo, what's good, guys? It's your boy Obars, the king of all vibes. Uh, I'm out here to support my brother, Godson, and um, Fly Kicks. We are here chilling. Um, basically, I have a new single out, so you guys should go and stream it. It's called Lower Body, featuring his lot and Jamo Piper. So, you all should stream that new song. Keep supporting the brand. Thank you very much. Big shout out to AIT. In Nigeria today, the only thing I can see significant growth is the entertainment industry. So it's awesome, it's very well, it's going well. The British Nigerian entrepreneurs who had created the several luxury pieces for American rapper Mick Mill, British rap duo Crept and Conan, Manchester City footballer Rhyme Stanley has also been the plug for several Nigerian celebrities, the DMW boss David O, the CEO of Zanka Records, Zlantan, Godson Ume expressed his joy for the continuous growth of the entertainment industry and his love for the Afrobeat hip-hop music. When I look at the fashion, Nigeria, Africa as a whole comes to mind. You have so many influences here, you have so many people that share the same passion that I do, so why not? Plus I'm from Nigeria, so why not bring it home to the motherland? I've made, I've made some pieces for some great people. I've been fortunate enough to make some pieces for like Zlatan, who's also a brother to me. It's his family. I've made pieces for Ramo Jago, Poka Lee. I feel like what you guys have got going over here is amazing. There's so many like up and coming talents, there's so many already made talents, and I just love to see like everyone's coming together as one and it's making the music thrive over here and it's, 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 I'm happy to be a part of the culture. Kogba Gidi, who also graced the occasion, gave his view on the importance of developing talent for the betterment of the society. Everything's already happening already and everybody's in enjoying themselves. You know the person doing the thing is damn one guy, Gosson and fly cakes. You already know they are wealthy most present. Although he had fallen out of his last talent portable, he said he's moved on and bids his fans to expect so much from him before the year comes to an end. My first interview that you're gonna hack because I've been running for an interview for some few more like like that because of some crazy things happening on social media like that. People don't know where I am, people just follow this social media. But if you get to know Kogbagi, you know that Kogbagi is a very, very calm person.